Good afternoon, visitors. Just a couple more minutes here. No one is allowed to come up to me and ask me when the next boat's coming in because the answer is 20 minutes. Um, yeah, but yeah, about 20 minutes we're going to have the boat come through. In about five-ish minutes or so we're going to have the bridge lift for it. So if you have to go to the restroom, now's the perfect time for a potty break. Also, somebody lost a pair of sunglasses. They're kind of brown. They're not my color. So I really hope somebody comes and collects them or we'll have to donate them in a year. But yeah, if you lost your sunglasses, I might have them. Time to copy, Minor at the area left bridge. Just starting up a little early for you, Captain. A good copy, thank you very much. See you then. All right, guys, the bridge is currently lifting to its full height of 135 feet for the departure of the Masabi Miner. It should be here in just about 10 to 15 minutes. Again, that's about 10 to 15 minutes to use the restroom before it gets here. Because um, you wouldn't want to miss the show. Good afternoon visitors, right now coming through the canal we have the Masabi Miner. The Masabi Miner was built in 1977 by the American Shipbuilding Company in Lorain, Ohio. She measures 1,004 feet in length, 105 feet in width, and 56 feet in depth. She is powered by two 8,000 horsepower, 16-cylinder peel stick diesel engines which give her a top speed of 15 knots or about 70 miles per hour. She's also equipped with a 1,500 horsepower bow thruster to aid her maneuverability in port. The Masabi Miner has 36 hatches on her deck which open into seven cargo holds located below deck. Each hatch covering measures 65 by 11 feet. She has a maximum carrying capacity of 63,300 tons. Above her deck is a 265-foot self-unloading boom which allows her to unload her own cargo at a rate of 10,000 tons per hour without the aid of shoreside equipment. The Masabi Miner is currently owned and operated by the Interlake Steamship Company of Middleburg Heights, Ohio. The Masabi Miner was built for $45.1 million in three different sections. The bow and stern sections were built in American Shipbuilding's Lorraine Yard, while the midsection was built in their Toledo Yard. It was later towed to Lorraine to be conjoined with the other two sections. The Masabi Miner had her maiden voyage to the Twin Ports in June of 1977, and was formally christened here in Duluth in honor of the people on the Masabi Iron Range. If you see any crew on board, make sure you give them a big wave and wish them a safe trip. Today they are all loaded up with iron ore that they got from Canadian National and they are headed to Cleveland today. They haven't given a salute yet. Maybe if you guys outside cheer loud enough, they just might do that. Okay, the cheering was a little weak. Maybe if you all do it together. Try it on one, two, three. Well, good job to you guys. Um, sorry the boat didn't care. But maybe when the pilot house gets a little closer, they will give you their salute.
heard is known as the Master's Salute. It is three long and two short blasts of the horn, initiated by the Masabi Miner and then reciprocated by the bridge. Thank you very much there, Earl Bridge. Uh, you stay safe and we'll uh, see you in about a week. Yeah, you bet, Cap. You guys have a safe trip and uh, we'll see you then. Uh, James, I'm 